Are you getting started at using an iPad 2? Here are some notes to help you. The important on off button is at the top and on the side for the volume. There is also a camera, a microphone and an earphone socket. There's another camera on the front at the top and the all important home button is at the bottom. You can choose to hold the iPad in portrait or landscape. Often, it depends on the application. You can choose different keyboards such as Spanish and Japanese. First, tap Settings and then tap General. Next, tap International and then tap Keyboards. Next, tap Add New Keyboard and choose. To edit your typing, touch and hold on the screen until you get a magnifying glass. Then drag to where you need to make a change. Use your finger to do everything. Tap to select. Drag one finger up or down to scroll. Two fingers moving apart to zoom in. Also double tap to zoom in on photos and web pages and again to zoom out. You can use two camera applications. Camera and photo booth. You can use two cameras. Tap the camera icon to swap back camera for filming other people to front camera for taking a photo of you. Remember to use rule of thirds as much as possible. Dirty screen? Use only soft, lint-free cloth. Definitely no cleaners or sprays. It's best to turn off and disconnect everything first. Hold the on off button until slide to power off shows and then drag the slider. More questions? You can download the manual at http colon slash slash manuals dot info dot apple dot com slash on underscore us slash ipad underscore two underscore user underscore guide dot pdf. By the way, it's a big file at 17 megabytes and 198 pages.